everybody. I'm here with Jordy, Jordan. Um, and we are slightly out of breath because we just got done chasing Lucky. The plan was to release Lucky at a feeder where we know there's sows and piglets. He's a male pig. He's not too friendly. He tried attacking Remy. He's just not a good fit for us. So I was going to release him, hoping that he could pack up with another uh, group of hogs, but trying to get him out of the car, he took off and ran. So now Lucky's on his own. He's been eating, so I know he can feed for himself, but it is what it is. I mean, we tried and it is what it is. Now we're going to take care of all this corn we just got because tomorrow we got to fill feeders and we're going to do a little coyote hunting because we have some coyotes on camera. Those Spartan cameras are awesome because we know what's going on. And there's Dylan with Aria. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, hey you guys, we're at the ranch now. We got breakfast this morning and we just got done loading up the buggy with a pile of corn because we have to go fill feeders. Let's ride. Are you call it one or two? Uh, one. One, maybe. One and a half. I call two. Yeah, we did. Another bag. Oh, who called it? Rob would be proud. I did say half a bag, but I see better than half. But I'm still in the run for this. That's one benefit of pulling up with the buggy because you don't even have to get off. And the boys are now on corn duty because I lifted a lot of corn already and being pregnant, I don't want to overdo it. So they're on corn duty and I'm driving the buggy. You, pull. you can't get no more corn in it. That's perfect. Like Rob said, this is an awesome feeder, but it's just a little too tall. So we're improvising with the angle. Remember the part I said about that being the hardest one? <laughs> yeah. I think we found it. <gasps> that's been tipped over but it's all good it's not broke and we'll just fill it quick and be done with it now we're headed back to camp and we're gonna load up and get on the Polaris and try to get a coyote the coyotes are just starting to come in pretty heavy, so we need to manage that and do a little predator control. <gasps> We're finally done! Are you so excited? That's all the bags that went in the feeders. We only have two left, which we'll finish tomorrow. Okay, let's see who wins. Best of three. 
Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! <laughs> no! And what does this mean, Dylan? I'm killing the coyote. Alright, we're in the Polaris. We're headed out to the box line. Try to get a coyote. back at the ranch and we're loading corn back on the buggy because today we got to finish filling feeders. Here, I'll grab this. We went and stopped at Jupiter Donut Factory, got a little bite to eat this morning, but we are very tired today, not gonna lie. Rob does this all the time. He's always managing the property, filling feeders and working hard. So while he's gone, it's only right to maintain the property and keep everything running smoothly. Right? Right. Let's do it. Right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> which is awesome, but I gotta check the batteries. Oh. We're getting a lot of deer to this feeder, which I'm beginning to think is probably because of the attractant we're putting out. Okay, you guys, this is the last feeder that we have corn for. It's been a long weekend. The boys have worked nonstop and they will probably be sore tomorrow. <laughs> and normally I'd be helping right now, but being pregnant, I don't want to carry too much because those are 50 pound bags and we just went through 40 of them in no time. While Rob's gone, I'll try to keep you guys in the loop of what's going on. And it's hard that, you know, your husband travels like he does, but I'm glad that he's able to do that and he has fun doing it. So you gotta try to catch up the slack that's missing here and work a little harder and keep everything flowing nicely. I hope you guys are having a great weekend. Like Rob always says, we appreciate you, we love you, and we will see you next time. We gone. <laughs>